Fortunately, unfortunately, I was the one in the video. So when she spit on me, I honestly wasn't mad. Yes, I felt disrespected, but I wasn't angry two multiple times that this is the front of the queue and you should totally go to the back and wait for your friend. It's not that you cannot wait for your friend, you can. Just do it at the back. Ya, seperti kalian lihat di video ini, karena viralnya ini di sosial media, akhirnya si cewek Indonesia tersebut klarifikasi dengan memberikan penjelasan yang masuk akal atas kenapa ia meludah. Dan tak hanya itu, orang Singapura yang diludahi tersebut juga menceritakan kronologinya yang sebenar-benarnya di video kali ini. Namun sebelumnya, bagi yang belum tahu kronologinya, pada awalnya si cewek Indonesia ini diduga memotong antrian konser Bruno Mars. Nah, pas memotong tersebut ada cewek yang dari Singapura itu menegur si cewek Indonesia dan akhirnya entah apa tiba-tiba bertengkar teman-teman nah karena si cewek Indonesia tidak terkontrol emosinya tiba-tiba ngeludahi si cewek Singapura tersebut seperti yang kalian lihat di videonya waduh waduh setelah ramainya berita ini cewek tersebut banyak yang ngehujat di sosial media pribadinya sampai akhirnya si cewek Indonesia tersebut klarifikasi dan menceritakan kronologi aslinya di sosial medianya teman-teman pada inti klarifikasinya dia mengatakan bahwa dia sebenarnya tidak memotong antrian dia hanya menunggu temannya yang ada di kamar mandi tapi sayangnya dia tidak tahu bahwa itu sebuah antrian tiket konser dan dia juga klarifikasi tentang alasan dia meluda teman-teman si cewek Singapura yang diludahin itu ternyata sebelumnya karena orang Indo ini memotong antrian si cewek Singapura itu melempar nasi gitu teman-teman katanya dan ya karena ngelempar nasi tersebut si cewek Indo itu marah dan terjadilah yang seperti dilihat di video tersebut oh iya diklarifikasinya dia juga mengakui dia salah karena sudah kayak gitu dia sungguh meminta maaf sebesar-besarnya nah si cewek Singapura ini ternyata juga menceritakan kronologinya dia menceritakan semuanya di video ini oke lah tanpa basa-basi kita langsung tonton saja bersama-sama Fortunately, unfortunately, I was the one in the video. <laughs> Bruno Mars was 10 over 10, and I don't want to harp on the negative things that happen, especially when it is so petty. Okay, so I'm just gonna make this video like really quick. People were asking me whether like I'm okay, like how am I feeling? Did she like hurt me or anything? And the answer was no, I wasn't hurt, and yes, I am okay. And then I got some questions asking like how was I so calm throughout the whole like audio. My answer is really simple, I'm just gonna make it really quick, okay? I was calm and I was composed because I felt like even if she spits on me, even if she slaps me, even if she kicks me, even if she claws off my entire face, even if she pulls off all the hair on my scalp, it doesn't change the fact that she's in the wrong for cutting cue. And that stuck by me throughout the whole audio like I don't care who you are, I don't care what you do to me but if you are in the wrong, whatever you do doesn't change the fact that you are in the wrong and personally the best way you can salvage this situation is either you apologize and just walk away or in the first place just don't cut Q it was that simple to me, it wasn't that complicated to be very honest so when she spit on me I honestly wasn't mad yes I felt disrespected but I wasn't angry Tonight, I am gonna be the one sleeping well knowing that I went down early in the morning to queue for my own spot in the standing pen. In the meanwhile, knowing that she's not gonna be the one sleeping well because she didn't come early for a standing pen and she still wanted to cut the queue and despite cutting the queue, she still wanted to argue about it. How do you sleep at night? And for me, that was a good enough reason as to why I wasn't mad at her for doing what she did. That was very self-explanatory why cutting cues was wrong. 
it was very self-explanatory why you should have gone to the back to wait for the friend. We have told you multiple times that this is the front of the queue and you should totally go to the back and wait for your friend. It's not that you cannot wait for your friend, you can. Just do it at the back. And this is what we have told you. And if you don't get it, or if you don't want to listen and things start to blow out of proportion, then you know who it's on. So yeah, the end. It wasn't a very good start to the concert, of course, but it didn't change the fact that Bruno was a 10 over 10, so whoever that is going on 6 April, have fun, stay safe, be hydrated, and yes, don't cut queue.